dead. The husband laughed and said to the interpreter, tell them we uncover it in your presence so that you may see and restrain yourself. Like, uh, he's saying that this is a way of you practicing control by yeah. them uncovering themselves in front of you. What? And being dirty as hell, too. Yeah, oh my God. Right. Then they say something about maggots or something. Or oh, yeah. That's the yeah. ice. Um, I'm going to think of, yeah, let me find that too. They said she had lice in her pussy or something. Um. <laughs> but even, uh, your boy General Patton, go back to good old Patton. The Jews assassinated him in World War II because he was coming out bringing all this truth about these Jews out. He, he, he said that they fought for the wrong side in the war. He said he uh, met the Jews over there in Germany. He said they was the foulest, filthiest sons of bitches he'd ever seen in his life. <laughs> he said one of them devils came up in front of him to talk to him. He said he almost passed out from the smell. Dang. And it's a general. It's a general talking. This ain't just anybody saying this. This is like the most respected general in American history saying this shit. And then they killed his ass. They assassinated his ass. Because he's going he's gonna to spill the bean on the Jews. Let me read some more of this. Um, this is better than when it is covered up and yet attainable. Adultery is alien to them. <laughs> Yet when they discovered that someone is the daughter they spent them for two paths. This they do by bringing together the branches of two trees. Just goes to say how they kill Um the custom to the splendid baths of Baghdad for our traveler could not get over the dirtiness of the Turks. The dirtiness of the Turks, because the Turks are Edomites. Like the Ottoman Turks, the royal house of the Ottomans, those are all Edomites. The Turks are related to the so-called Jews. Just saying that, you know, the Mong. we talked about this a couple weeks ago. Uh, Genghis Khan. Yeah, Genghis Khan is an Edomite. Genghis Khan is a white man. So are the Turks. That tells you how stupid those nation of Islam fools are to be wearing the, uh, be wearing the fezes. <laughs> the, 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 the same castle hat. Who brought the nation of Islam here to America with Master for all the A Turk. A Turk, a white man. Mm -hmm. Hey, yeah, like Edomite, to be more precise. Yeah. They, they, they looking at it like it's some fucking prophet came because he's, he's said he's a prophet in the nation of Islam. And they don't even know that that red fez represents their hats being dipped in Christian like blood, you. being dipped in Israelite blood. Imagine that. I tell you how stupid they are, man. Stupid. Goddamn Muslim. The goods do not wash oh, themselves. That go back to Farrakhan. That's how we know Farrakhan set up. The whole nation of Islam is all set up. It was set up from the beginning, like he said, by an Edomite. And that's why they killed Malcolm X. But Malcolm X was going against the, uh, Esau's teachings, against their doctrine, because their doctrine was to control your ass. No. And he started going uh, against their doctrine. They and, killed him. And he was posing, uh, what they call it, thing. he was molesting, uh, oh, molesting yeah. kids and shit. Yeah, they killed Malcolm X. And then you got videos of, so they're murderers. You know what I'm saying? You ain't supposed to be murdering people. They got videos of Farrakhan on YouTube bragging about murdering Malcolm X. Bragging about it. Like it was funny. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Well, it is funny. He's a Muslim. That's what you get. <laughs> That's all it is. Nation of Islam is just organized. It's, part, it's an extension. It's a branch of the Jewish Mafia. Hey, they got videos of YouTube. You can watch with Louis Farrakhan playing the violin with the Jewish orchestra. I'm not making that up. That's true to me. Look at through history. Jake, then everybody's put somewhere in orbits. That's how they do it. And your boy Farrakhan good on that violin too. He be on it like mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> fucking, we have been up a show, man. A big fucking show. I remember we made a video a long time ago clowning on him. We got thousands of views. People, he's getting death threats. Remember that shit back when he came out? And he, oh, Louis Farrakhan teaches the black people are eating like. That's what I told him. That he told you That's what he got an actual video. And, it, it, and then when you people are watching, they'll, de they'll deny it. And we'll be, like, we'll be like, didn't you see the video where he said y'all are Edomites? No, he said we're Israelites. I'm like, no, we didn't. He clearly said y'all from Esau. 
He did too. Yeah, he tried to say that uh, that he tries to say that the angel that Jacob wrestled with is it was Esau, and that Esau is God, and the black man is God, and he's Esau. That's what he teaches. Look, I got that book you gave to me. The the. Uh, White man. I know it's hard to concentrate on these hoes walking by. <laughs> yeah, the origin of the white, history of the white man, origin of the white man, the making, of the, the making of the white. I still, I know where it's at. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring that book out one week and let y'all see some of the madness that's contained therein. All the headache, all the headache knowledge. Man, I read that book. It said, yeah. And honestly, I don't think there's an inch of truth in it. It said Moses was a white man. <laughs> Moses was, no, 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 no. He said the Israelites were white people and Moses led the, the white people out of the caves. That's right, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said the Israelites were white people in the caves and he, Moses led them out of the caves. Where the fuck did he get this shit from? Wow. That's what they teach. Hey, my dumb ass in the 90s reading that book, man. Oh, this is some knowledge. This is some wisdom and knowledge right there, bro. This ain't now. now. Israel dwelling in the cleft of the rock. <laughs> right, right. They ain't nowhere in Israel. That was Esau in the cleft of the rock. Yeah. <laughs> he got it backwards. But that's how we know he's set up. Because the nation of Islam, like the brother said, was started by a, by an Edomite. By a goddamn Turk. But that goes back to that book he's reading and talking about the Turks. The Turks are the same people as the Jews. Yeah, you can tell that story. So you went up to the Some of them pieces of shit accepted Islam. Some of them pieces yeah. of shit accepted uh, Judaism. Yeah, because a lot of the Jews converted to Turks. Like, mm -hmm. that, uh, what's that? Sabotage Zevi, that faggot. Whatever his name is. <laughs> that bitch. <laughs> fucking rat. <laughs> Get some more of this juice out of here. The juice. He said this juice. <laughs> yeah, this is a stink, man. This, shit. this is a bad book, man. The Haguz did not wash themselves after defecating or urinating. That's a so-called Jew for you. They never wash themselves. They're the filthiest creature on the face of the earth. Mm. Nor do they bathe after seminal pollution or on other occasions. What the fuck, man? They refuse to have anything to do with water. They refuse. Oh, yeah. Hey, check this out. Particularly in winter. So right now, it's like they, oh, yeah, they them water waters like kryptonite and oh, yeah. <laughs> Superman. So you know they're not really Israelites. Yeah, right, right. Because you read the Bible and shit. We had pools up in Bethlehem, uh, up in Jerusalem. We're in the pool with an angel and touch it and bless it. You get up in the pool, you man. Oh. All over Italy right now, Spain, they got bad houses. Yeah, bad houses. Yeah. You know they know but Israel over Italy and Spain. Yeah, there's all kind of uh, laws in the Bible about how you got to clean yourself. You got to shit? Oh, that's nasty. This, this shit. Try fucking a Get bitch after she take a shit no oh, more. Oh, hell no, man. That bitch spread her legs and that funk come out, man. Put it in her doggy style. Ooh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. The yeah. smell yeah. just comes up. Damn. It's already like right there, too. Yeah. Yeah. I've experienced that in real life. Mm -hmm. These bitches is nasty. Don't know how to wash their yeah, ass. Then my body heat get the going. Because you gotta actually tell people, man, you're supposed to take a uh, take a shower every day. Yeah, this bitch I used to fuck with, I met here at Old Shoe. She works at Child Court now. Man. She went upstairs, came back down, she said, I had diarrhea. <laughs> Took her clothes off where the fuck. Oh, I'm man, like, man, I gotta <laughs> This is too much. <laughs> she came down and told me I had diarrhea. Like she just you ready? Man. You ready? I'm like, oh. <laughs> hey, like, man. That's not. Didn't I hear no water running or nothing? <laughs> this is going straight on. I've YouTube. always been like that, hearing what a woman doing. Yeah, yeah. You know, I've always been like that. Let me hear some water. Let me hear some water. Let me hear some I just think about a bitch eats pork. I mean, that make a, eating pork can make a woman stink. It does. Well, well, their whole metabolism is different than a man. It's weaker than a man, and that, that pork comes right out the pores, man. Come out the pussy. Oh, that, that's true, because uh, some gas stations only had one bathroom. <laughs> oh, man, that's nasty. Ooh. And I had to go in after this bitch. Oh, man. Oh, man. You, you, you actually felt the heat 
and smell good. Yeah, smell like. Yeah, yeah. Well, have you never, uh, you ever do janitor? You ever do, yeah, uh, right, you ever do janitor work? Be a custodian? Mm -hmm. The woman's bathroom was always nastier than the men's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, they be, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I had these, uh, strippers who date stay in my house for like a week. And I had, uh, two and a half baths. And they always used to have that. Man, you, I ain't gonna go to this man. Oh, man, I don't know what's going on there. Man. He already I said too you. much. My wife used to clown on it, too, man. She used to have fun on that shit. She used to have fun on that shit. <laughs> yeah, there was some cool ass bitches on it. That's true. Niggas was fighting for me. I mean, I used to, we used to go out there to the metal bars and shit. I mean, niggas spending their rent money on this place, man. Oh, fuck yeah. I seen it. I seen it. You ain't gonna see me paying for no bitch. These are the nastiest bitches I can ever think of. Man. These bitches gotta pay me. Shit. You know? And you wonder why these medications ain't working no more. <laughs> I saw I need a bitch to buy me some shoes or something. You me. You me. Yeah, buy me some shoes, some clothes, buy my kids some shit. Let me tell you something, man. I always make a mistake to say these fat bitches are buying look out for you. All these bitches will, man. Yeah, I don't say will. the right lie to them, man. All these dumb bitches. These bitches are stupid. That's why I gotta, I gotta step my hustle up. Hey, it's a great. Spend too much time. <laughs> very easily to be, very easily to see. I don't want to spend too much time doing that. Uh, and, uh, these bitches real well, I can't. I be too busy studying, man. I don't really hang it. That's the thing about these women. A lot of y'all fall out the truth because of a woman. You a lot just, of motherfuckers ain't worthy of the truth because they know what Bitch will make you fall out the truth. Oh, you see, you see got more than that? Hell yeah, it's This is going back to the so-called Jew. When the girl's commander-in-chief no took off his like luxurious coat a brocade to don a new coat, the mission had brought him. They saw that his underclothes were fraying apart from dirt. For it is their custom <laughs> never to take off the garment they wear close to their bodies until it disintegrates. What? <laughs> you, you two just here with the with this campaign. <laughs> you think he was doing a comedy book or something? Like this was like some Dave Chappelle shit or something. Yeah. This is an actual, he just. He said it is for, it is for bidding for them to take. Here, here, read that. This is just, just a witness. Start right here. I gotta give me a copy of that book. Just saw it there. <laughs> but people are trying to say, oh, that book's not real. That's been. That book is 100% real, 100% true. Disintegrates. <laughs> I'll be damned if I'm living like that. The disintegrate. Yeah, no. Disintegrate. That's a Jew. That's why you watch some Jews when they walk down the street. They wearing a big old black nasty coat. It be hot as hell in the summertime. They wearing that thick ass wool coat. Mm -hmm. They never take it off. And can you imagine, folks, if they're not washing after they shit, your shit burns your skin. Can you imagine? They might got. Uh, you know, ooh, bad song. They nasty, man. We ain't just making that shit up, man. It's a city. So look, I was kind of all words. So I got to drop by them Jews every day. You see how dirty they are. Up right here in Bexley. I got to go through Bexley every day. I, I'm right by them devils, okay? And I see how filthy they are. And that's the funny thing is, the day I met him, I had a Jew whip. Oh, yeah? Remember that? This bitch would go. She wanted a real Two, three days with me. Oh no, man. Don't say Without that. Without bathing. Oh man. 